Today, I have hired out one of the most haunted mansions in the UK. Me, Scott and Tubbo are gonna go in there and see if we can find real ghosts. You'll notice that Scott and Tubbo aren't here with me right now. And that is because before they arrive, we're gonna go in there and rig up stairs so we guarantee reaction from them. This is by far the stupidest, crazy vlog. This is literally a haunted mansion, all right? And I could die to ghosts. So if you do enjoy this, please feel free to subscribe and make it worth my while because this is terrifying. They are here, they've just arrived. So we're gonna go outside and uh, Intro time. Today we have hired this entire haunted mansion with one goal, finding ghosts in real life. So get us KFC! <laughs> Tobo is very attached to the fact that his KFC didn't arrive before he got here. He won't let go of it. Please subscribe so we can buy this boy a KFC. Let's go. This is all the phasmophobia kit. That's head cam from I was, phasmophobia. I was not told that we need to carry things. Yeah, you do. You need to carry oh, EMF oh, reader okay. and UV torch. Not <laughs> look at see. Tubcam enabled. Hello, Tubcam. It's me. I'm here. If you were Tubbo, you would look at this right now. All right, boys. It's time to go. Where are we going? Onwards. This way. We just go in there and start hunting, boys. It is already flashing at five. <laughs> what? Now, I don't know if I stressed this hard enough in the intro, but this place is actually haunted. When this EMF reader went off to five, I was genuinely a little bit spooked. There's nothing I can do to rig that. That's real. What, you Tom, what are you looking at, Tomo? Stop shining the, the laser at things. Oh, you're really turning on the yeah. thing? Oh, Ghosts in this room. Do you want to speak to us? Tomo, come speak to the ghost with us. What's your name? I think we go to different rooms. Yeah. Tubbo? Onwards, Tubbs. What's your time? It's lit. Why is this one woman lit up? Why are they only... I do question why there's pink ones. Yeah, I noticed all, all the time. seats have pine cones on them. Ghosts. What's in the name of the ghosts? There was one called Mad Jack. There was Sister or something. Oh, the, the white lady. Yeah, the nun. Wow. Stop, stop, stop bouncing lasers off of mirrors. We're trying to hunt ghosts. I don't want to find it. Do you not believe in the paranormal, Tubbo? No, I just don't want to find any ghosts. I was quite happy not interacting with the ghost. Well, I, for one, wish to speak to the Mad Jack. Are you here? Okay? No, no, shh, shh, shh. This is my producer, Tim. His job was to go around and make sure all the scares we planned happened exactly when we needed them to. I swear I heard a noise upstairs. Like, I, I swear to God I heard a noise. There's a noise upstairs. There is a noise up there. Tubbo, there's a noise upstairs. How do we lose Tubbo? How do we lose Tubbo, we can't lose you. Where did you go? How do you just leave? That way. Tubbo, we, we unironically heard a noise upstairs. Why are there so many weird paintings? Southeast bedroom. You lived here then, eh? I actually know this one. They told me about this. From what I know about this room, okay. the sisters lived in here. Now, one of the sisters, normal. One of the other sisters, suspected to be a medium slash psychic. Her second fiance died mysteriously by tripping on a rug and stabbing himself in the chest. What? KFC? <laughs> is, is that the KFC? Ooh, you can't be in a haunted place and go, is that the KFC delivery? Mm. No, it's not. It's... You scared, Jack? No. Now, I know I look scared here, all right? I'm just a great actor. I knew full well that that was Tim, and I was just trying to hype up some fear in the boys. The only thing is, it didn't work. For some reason, they were not scared at the prospect that a ghost may have just rang a bell. And before you question it, no, they had no idea it was Tim. I told them that he would be downstairs working on some other stuff we had planned. They had no clue he was doing this. They just didn't care. Oh, everything in here is so weird, man. The door, look at the door. This is pretty. Why is it? Stop filming pretty thing. The doors are slanted. Oh. That's weird. I like these glasses are older than us. Really? 1730 to 17. 1740. 1738? No, it just says 1730. <laughs> I don't see no ghosts. We've not seen any ghosts yet, but we haven't really tried much. You can try talking again. Xbox. Xbox? Xbox. <laughs> I love gaming! That's such a creepy noise and I hate it. Look. It looks like there's ghost orbs on the camera. Every so often yeah. you see Mad something Jack. like fly past Mad the Mad Jack, we're in your home and you didn't get to inherit it from your mother. That's his, that's his gripe. Ooh, what the- Tubbo, yeah. the services are required in this room. Tubbo, why don't you speak to the ghost by yourself alone in this room? I'll stand here and go behind the door. They won't see me. I'm hidden. Hello. <laughs> Oh, That's hi. FM radio. Yeah. You're, all you're gonna pick up is local radio stations yeah, like I'm Brighton FM. FM. Hello. That was definitely Avril Lavigne. We don't need this. Hello. I brought you a huge fan. <laughs> this room, they told me a story about this. It was the most paranormally active room in the house. That's why it felt creepy. Yeah, they told me that all the stories come from this room. Apparently, actually, earlier today, 
They said that this bed looked slept in and that this had moved when the workers came in this morning. They told me that when I showed up. Oh. This was completely true. It wasn't something I made up to try and scare them. I'd actually been told that when I walked in. I did not lie when I said I booked a haunted mansion. I was going to say there was also sightings of like hands at the ends of beds and also like a toddler playing with a toy. In this... Just in the house, Jack. I, they didn't specify the rooms. There was a creak, Scott, and I panicked. Wait, should we try and speak? We didn't try and speak properly. Tell me I'll just listen uh, to FM radio. Is anyone there? They're like me. It's okay, Scott. I will commune with them. Hello. What did I say? What did I say? Are you in this room? Okay, the first one was definitely a radio signal, but when I said, are you in this room, there was more of a raspy voice. Give us a sign. Give us a sign, don't give us a sign, don't move anything. Hold on to the railing, I don't trust the ghost, so I'll push me down the stairs. Why is it so far? I don't know, just keep going. Why is there a door in here? Where is that? Go. To death! Is this a drop? I've got a duck, I've got a duck. Watch, I'll film me ducking just to prove I'm not short. Yeah, actually, it was on his toes there. I did it! This is like, oh, I don't like this one, actually. Why is this not on Oh, it's a big aircon unit. Abide with us, he will fulfill. We can just add a picture of Dream. The audience will laugh harder if it's a picture of Dream. It might be scary demon man. You've just said, let's replace it with Dream. No wonder the ghosts don't want to talk to us. Maybe we should turn that on right now. Yeah, it closed. Ah. Why would you do these things? <laughs> Why hoping, are you problematic? I was hoping you would jump. Oh shit, wait, oh, oh. What was Are you sure? Yeah, that bell was not one of those bells. Yeah, that was it. That was a damn bell. Are you sure? Yes. That wasn't one of our bells. I don't know who did that. As far as I'm aware, none of us rigged that. If I sound confused at the time, that's because I am. I have no idea what's going off. And I still right now could not tell you what might have caused that other than a ghost. Oh, that's freaky. Wait, why are you even oh, swinging? I just realized we're in like the servants' quarters because these is where the people would ring the bells to tell the servants like, hey, we I want something in the drawing room. room. There's a room through here. Unless it was th through here and we just heard it wrong. I just assume door shut means no entry. Waste not want that. Where are the rooms? noise from upstairs. I heard that. Scan the ceiling. Get the ghost. Come on, you just stood frozen looking through a door. No, something, it looked like something moved at the other side of the window, but I can't tell if it was just- There's also a dead pheasant yeah. there. That is a dead animal. Did that do anything? No. no. Come on, swapsy. I'll figure it out. He's gonna figure out EMF. <laughs> Stop blowing. He's got a ghost disease. He got ectoplasm. Right. Let's go upstairs. Lead the way. Now, telling Scott to lead the way right there might have been the smartest thing I did all evening because it gave me chance to do this. Oh, shit! Brick! Piss off! What? What? Oh, the bell oh, is still taxing me. Wait, 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 wait. That's bedroom number two, does that count? Yeah, I don't mean it, the ghost will be in bedroom number two if it's trying the bell. I was we could go to the bedroom. Oh, we're on Scott cam. Scott cam. I ruined my hair for this. Thank you, Scott. I couldn't bear to ruin mine. All three hairs that you have. There's more than three, they're just short. Like you. No, I had to duck under the door. We run back the clip where I ducked under the door. It keeps flickering in here, Scott. Yeah, like when we're in the hallway, it does, like the EMF flickers. See, the other bedrooms are those two little creepy ones. Yeah, but they're not nice. Surely they're like servant rooms or something? Just I doubt they bells. No, look, there's bell wire here. Did you order room service? <laughs> oh, this is the haunted room. Here. That went off a lot, Tobo. I saw that in the reflection of the window. I thought, Scott, are you brave? Well, I don't know. Don't. Hello? If you're in this room, we just want to talk to you. We don't want to do anything. Like fuck boys. <laughs> that really? You want a what now? This one's a little bit weird. We can't control what the spirit box says. I made out that it said something stupid at the time because I thought it was funny, but listening back this time, I'm like 90% sure it said sacrifice, which is a little bit creepy. If you're here, say something. That's fucking weird. Are you in the closet? Not, not like in like. Maybe, it was olden yeah. times. There's only one room we've not been in yet, right? That's the one at the start. You wanna go back through the bells and back up? You wanna go past the bells again? Yeah, in no. case something happened. <laughs> <laughs> Tomo's like, no. That definitely means we should. Is there yeast in you? There's definitely something in the bread. It's got something. It's ghost bread. Hello? Say hi to me, ghost bread. I'm not here to hurt you or eat you, you delicious, delicious bread. When it's down here, it's like really high. Is it a child ghost? 
Yes. That makes it creepier. It's got to be something to do with something. Else. Well, are you being skeptical? Are you saying it's not ghosts, Toby? Is that what you're saying? Let's turn the light off. We're just going to stand in pure silence. We're just going to see if we hear anything. Toby's got his fingers in his ears. Toby doesn't want to hear any ghosts. Toby, 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 Toby. Oh, I'm sorry for doing this to you. Okay, I think we tried that one room we got been in. Let's check other rooms. Let's go. Oh, this is cool. I'm on the flashlight. This is big. It's weird. Here. There's no need to be shy, ghosts. You can give the pine cones. It's weird that they're like sat in a living room as if they're watching us. These ones are playing whatever this is. <laughs> You've never heard of Crane? You've heard of the classic game of Crane? What's the point of the game of Crane? Explain to Pegs. And you do what? Pegging. You're pegging? Oh, <laughs> the, the thing went to five for that one. It did not enjoy that comment. Maybe, or maybe it did. Oh, it's Who true. are you to judge? I think it's too dark. It's really blue around that lot. It's just that patch there. It's weird and blue. Yeah. That is a little bit weird, actually. That whole patch is, like, showing up more. And that bit's cold. Should we try to speak to them in here? This is the last room yeah. we haven't tried speaking to them in. Come, gentlemen. Let us sit in, on, in, on the ground. Are you here? What is your name? What's your name? I said that twice now, but I don't know what it is. What's your name? Why would that speed up so fast? There we go. I can't understand. Whenever we ask what is your name, that same thing is said, but I can't understand it. Can you please give us a sign? Sounded a little bit like you said, I'm close. Are you nearby? It did sound like close. Yeah. Now, you can probably see in my eyes that this is the first time throughout the whole night I'd been genuinely a little bit freaked out. I don't know exactly what it was, but I think it was the idea that I'd had nothing to do with any of the things that were happening in that moment, and still we were getting results. After all the stories I've been told about ghosts, we were actually speaking to one, supposedly, and that was weird. It didn't help that throughout all this, Scott and Tubbo still weren't very scared. I'd scared Tubbo once, and I was getting scared. That wasn't even the point. Are you having a nice day? Thank you, Tubbo. He said yes. That said yes. That, that genuinely very said clearly yes. said yes. All right, Tom, you just clearly have the yeah. special powers. Don't cover it. Ask it something. Speak to it. Too loud. What's that noise? What noise? Did you not hear like a noise? Oh, look, wait, 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 wait. There's a motion detector. <laughs> if there's any ghosts, we're going to see them because of the motion detector. Oh, yeah, don't make it, don't move. Wait, did you see that person move? There was a person, you can see the shadow in the background. Like, I'm going to stop and just play the footage. So like when I was filming the that bit, well, like around here, you don't see the shape of the person. Like there. Oh, what? That is a very obvious human being. Look, I see. Just walk behind the curtain. You see him? It might be Tim. Why would it be Tim? This was a problem. Tubbo had completely hit the nail on the head. It was Tim. Me saying motion detector was Tim's cue to walk past slowly because we figured it'd make everyone look at that wall so they'd see him. Luckily for me, this was the first time anyone had suspected anything we were doing. So, no one was too suspicious of me yet. Oh, that, that one. That is the family's older seance room where they would communicate with the ghosts. Why is there always a twist to these things? I thought we'd just get to look at a nice house. Here's the seance room. So supposedly, I set up some like, lighting in here. Have you ever... No, and I, I really don't want to use that pool. I actually have like a genuine thing with Ouija boards. I didn't realize you were going to bring one. Oh, great, yes. This is where I realized I'd made a drastic mistake throughout the whole night. Upon researching this place, we kept reading stories about a ghost dog. Apparently, Preston Manor is haunted by a ghost dog. So I thought throughout that whenever creepy things happen and they got a bit scared, I'd be like, haha, it's the ghost dog. You know, to kind of tease them a bit. The only thing is, getting a little bit creeped out myself, I completely forgot to mention the ghost dog. That's why this reveal was a little bit strange. Jack is laughing because his energy is building because he's the portal now. What? The portal is going oh, through Jack. Oh, I don't want to be a portal. I want to be a boy. You want to go back to your boyhood. You want to go back, back, back in time. You want to go back to the days of your ancestors before Jack. To his grandparents, his great grandparents, beyond after they are there. Oh. Do, uh, do I keep my eyes closed? Danger feels uh, pretty in it. <laughs> Is that the hound? 
Wow, this fella is here. <laughs> yeah! I was gonna let them know they've been had by showing them a big dog and going, look, it's the ghost dog. And they'd be like, shit, he's had us. But I never mentioned the ghost dog. So all they know is they went on a haunted tour and then randomly at the end, a big dog showed up and I've never felt more stupid. <laughs> Rigged a couple of things up. Really? Boys. That wasn't the real dog that you still left here in 1843? <laughs> <laughs> you are even mad that you, you, you got tricked into thinking bells are real. And I got to like look at Arlen's house. What? What about you? Why? <laughs> Why? Because it's funny. It made me laugh to scare you. Don't get scared. Then you lied to him. This has been the worst day for him. Yeah, no, I kind of rigged up the bells and the footsteps and the dog. Really? That was the most convincing part of it. Well, this was anticlimactic. These boys don't seem to care at all. Oh, yeah, but we should. Yeah. Sorry, yeah, yeah, sounds. We've gone into a real seance, so we don't want to take anything home with us, Jack. Now, this part really freaked me out. I was ready to end the video. Like, I was outroing and everything. When the lady we'd hired to do the seance, the fake seance, told me that apparently she just held a real seance and was actually qualified to do that. And if I didn't sit down and close the portal that we'd created within me, then I would take ghosts home and be haunted. Now, usually I'm a skeptic, but when someone who's qualified in this stuff tells you that, you just get scared. It's a haunted mansion. What was I supposed to do? So the next bit of footage you're about to see is of me in genuine fear. I thought, I honestly kind of figured the seance was a bit fake. Yeah. I didn't realize we were going to have to close the portal afterwards. Yeah, no. Oh, great. Well, how did I come away from this vlog the most scared? Well, this ended not the way I wanted it to. Just please subscribe and make this vlog my world. Don't, why are you doing things to me? I'm not, I'm not in the mood. Just leave me alone.